Good afternoon. The judge did not go easy on a man who killed a Belen father and nearly killed his young daughter. He was sentenced to 17 years in prison, partially because he didn't learn his lesson after doing the same thing a decade ago. News 13's Madeline Schmidt was in the courtroom when Jacob Williams was sentenced. She joins us live outside the Valencia County Courthouse. Well, Kim, both times Williams killed the driver of the motorcycle and left the passenger severely injured. Both families of the victims were in the courtroom today pleading with the judge. Anything less than the maximum sentence is, is hardly acceptable by our family. The first crash happened near Berlin in August 2006. While driving drunk, Williams struck and killed Quinn Sanchez and paralyzed Sanchez's friend and passenger on the motorcycle, Mary Ann Madrid. Williams was sentenced to six years in prison, but got out after three years. Then, in January last year, Williams again drove drunk near Berlin and hit two people on a motorcycle, this time killing Daniel Sanchez, not related to the first victim, and injuring his 11-year-old daughter. Those three little babies will not have their dad anymore. They will not have him for the milestones in their life. Before the judge announced Williams' sentence, the courtroom watched a video of then 11-year-old Megan Sanchez screaming in pain after her leg was nearly destroyed in the crash. Now, families of both victims say that they are still hurting, but at least satisfied that Williams received the maximum sentence in this case, 17 years. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Madeline. Now, Megan, the then 11-year-old, has since recovered. She is now playing sports. Now, Williams received 10 years for killing Sanchez. The seven other years were for injuring Megan.